here. Hello, YouTube. Yes, I have fish in my inventory. Uh, sorry, I had to redo this video because I realized I was full screen recording. But, um, you go over to this guy. You can buy seeds from him. Once you start up, you'll probably have 1k. Once you Just buy uh, three of these. Once you have three of these with your 1k, plant them for right now while you wait for them to grow. Now, it might not just be that. If that's the case, go around, explore, grab items, sell them, then go plant. While you're waiting for those to grow, you can actually do everything in game. Then you can come back here, grab those, sell them up here. This is a little bit of a help for a starting guide. When you come here, you can sell. This is why I have fish in my inventory, so I can show an example. You can sell those. You can sell everything you find, collect. Um, for example, you can look around for mushrooms. And we're going to do a starting guide for you guys, pretty much. Alright, I'm slow at first. I hate it. But this is what I did last night. While I was waiting for the stuff to grow, I would fish. Now, some people might find fishing boring, which is why I'm going to say go around, collect. Because it's not just this that you can do. There's also mining. As you can see, there's a pickaxe in the hop, hop bar. But um, just letting you guys know, you don't have to do fishing. There's other things. I do fishing mainly because I do not like dying. But when you cast the fishing rod, you wait for a smoke or fog or whatever you want to call it to come up above right plus mm -hmm. and you pull in your fishing rod by click um right clicking right or is that left clicking? no it's left, left. Clicking. i'm but tired. you hold the left click no actually you don't have to hold the left click i found out i thought you that's what you told me i thought that's what i had to do because every time i clicked it it didn't actually pull sometimes Mm-hmm. That's the same problem I had. I realize you don't have to hold it. But for some reason, it wouldn't come in half the time. So we would hold mm -hmm. it. But yeah, just fish here until your inventory is full. And we are back. My inventory is now full, as you can see. So we're going to go sell this. And it's now night time. I would not recommend leaving during night. Ghosts. It, when you're starting off, ghosts can practically one-shot you. So, I, I recommend just trying to be in the town. Unless if you don't mind and just keep wanting to explore, then go for it. But once you get your inventory full, you can either press Q and press the home button, like some people do. But then you have to wait a full in-game day cycle. For it to refresh, I suggest using that for an emergency. So, sell all of your stuff that you got. And this will also work if you're going around collecting like ores with mining. Like, you can go mine. Or you can go fighting, but most likely you'll probably die right away. But I wouldn't worry about that. I would just suggest uh, going mining for right now, which a mining place should be somewhere down that way. If you go north a bit, you'll see some ores and you can just come back to the south. Now, after the fishing, the paid that I did, go over here, see if these things are done. They are not done, so we'll come right back. We'll probably go fish a little bit more, but I believe Beats take um, 15 minutes, right? Beats? Yeah, they take about 15 minutes. Like anything in the first slot takes about 15 to 30 minutes. You'll find that out. Now these are fully grown. Grab these. My suggestion is definitely planting if you're gonna planting while you're waiting. I know it might be. Be at risk, but hey, if you can at least buy one seed or two from 
after you fish go for it plant then explore if you don't want to stay there fishing because fishing can be quite boring but it can also be quite rewarding okay as you saw me sell my fish earlier now since we sold that let's do the next part that would actually come in handy after you get like a certain amount if you're looking for some useful items let's start with this a useful item all right this is a very big risk but is good i'm gonna walk all the ways over here it's slow my suggestion is to get some jump boots I'm going to talk to him. Gives me some walk speed, as you can see. It's plus four walk speed. It's better than these ones. Ah, I like these. It will definitely help. All right. I'm going to go to Vanity. I'm going to equip this because I do not want to look at my blue boots. Sorry. Blue's good and all, but they kind of stick out in this game. Alright, now since we got that done, I have 76,000 left over. I'm going to go buy some armor, and I'm going to show you some locations since we're in the town. Oh, I should show you where, where I just came from. This is the town square. See that? Um, raccoon looking badger thing you go to the left go this way go up this way take a turn here as you can see there's a pickaxe you can stop here go in and buy mining tools you don't need to worry about that for right now over this way this thing with a bear and gun looking icons which is right near the fishing area go that way or you can go down this way to get up here um, you go in here you talk to him you can buy your weapons and stuff from here I would not worry about them. well actually guns can be useful at first because they're cheaper than magic if you're looking for a long range but I would not worry about the pellet gun not worth it in my opinion even ask Bloss didn't do a lot of damage, right? No. So, you'd like, you'd have to come up here first. Let's do a budget for armor. This is where you go for armor. Okay. Let's see. We have 76,000. I would try going for the titanium armor, but I don't have enough for all that. So for right now, I'm not going to worry about it. I'm going to go for Cobalt. Like, just make a little money from fishing. No big harm. Right, boss? Mm-hmm. Now, whatever money you have left over, definitely go for something that you think would be good. I will go with a Cobalt uh, Skimeter. It's plus 70. Not really worth it, in my opinion. But I'm weak. I can't complain. It's better than this thing that does 12 damage. Anyway. Now, um, since you're all ready, I'm going to show you where the mining area is before I end this video. Like I said, you come out here. But before we go to the mining... I'm going to go grab some seeds and plant them real quick since I suggested this. So it will come in handy. 
Buy some seeds. I forgot to earlier, but I wanted to get some armor. I'm gonna buy four of these. One, two, three, four. Plant. Plant. Now these will take 30 minutes. And we're gonna go mine. Maybe I should get a better pickaxe. What do you think, boss? Mm -hmm. I noticed with pickaxes, when you get them, yeah. they just upgrade the speed. Oh, then how about we how fast you mine? Okay, then how about we upgrade the pickaxe real quick? I've learned that from a YouTube video. Hmm. But I just want to compile all the tips and tricks to help people out right away. See, I have uh, 30k. I'm gonna actually spend the whole entire 30k and get some titanium. Why should I just get? I'll just buy this one. I'll get the cobalt. I'll make it matching because I just realized there's another thing that can help you all. Click this. Instead of spending the whole entire 30k, I should also get this other piece that can help you everybody here since I have a decent amount we're gonna go I would probably go for this one if you have it because we'll give you plus five magic but for right now because you guys don't have that just go with this one but that's my preference because I like using magic okay you don't really have to worry about that go to equipment this will go here. It'll give you a little bit more sight range. It's not a lot, but if you can get 100k, there is something you can do to help with the fog, but um, I'm not going to talk about it. Not in this video. All right, we go. Wait, we're going north. We go north. North. Down. Once we get down here, we can go mining. And we're going to do another cut of this video. Alright, and I'll be back when my inventory is full. Alright, right now my inventory is not full. But once you get some ores, you can come here to actually smelt them. I'll show you how to get up here. Once you smelted the ores, you'll get something like this, an iron bar. I'll go down and I'll mine again, but I also should show you how to get up here as well. It's right near where you go for the uh, armor, right there. See that? It's right over here. You can use the furnace. So we're going to go back down, get some more ores, and come back up. I had to actually do a little skedaddle because an ant showed up, tried um, offing me. And I was like, no, 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 I'm not dying. Bloss had to save me. It sure did. Sure did. I just Which thought, I, don't. I, just thought I, like... I would show from a perspective on what you guys can do. Now, ores can also sell for quite a bit, like iron bars. 125, but titanium ore goes for a lot as well. You know? Why don't we come down here again? Pick up some more ores. I think I need copper and... Or do I need iron and coal? So I know you need coal to actually smelt. Iron. Coal. I keep freaking out because I thought you. <laughs> I looked up and I saw something with uh, some magic eye blossoms. You look like Hi. You're, you look like you're ready to murder someone. Uh no. But yeah. I'm trying to find these things you can collect to sell as well if you don't want to actually uh, fish. Oh. 
Ah, oh. Well, this is where I'm going to end it, because I just want to show you some example stuff on what you guys can do. I died. And that's more than enough. Uh. <laughs> that's more than enough to actually end a series. Anyway, I hope this helps whoever needs it. Okay. Farming plus fishing. Farming, then going yeah, out and I'm mining. Too. Farming and <laughs> going and collecting items can actually help. Because this way, when you get done collecting, fishing, or mining, you can make a profit by just collecting your crops once they're fully grown. Once they're fully grown, you can pluck them, go sell them. And it's also, it also helps with the relief if you died. Because if you died like I did, you have something to look forward for to actually sell. No big deal. Anyway, thank you for watching. And this is Bloss. Hi. See ya.